A friend in New York emailed me that he'd seen a new Australian film at the Tribeca Film Festival and had been very impressed. It was Bitter and Twisted, an independent first film from writer, director and co-star Christopher Weeks. It's about a family consumed by the death of their oldest son, Liam, three years earlier. The father, Jordan, Steve Rogers, has withdrawn emotionally from his wife, Penny, Noni Hazelhurst, and she's hurting. You make me feel like I'm 80. Don't yell, the kids will hear. So? So? Where are you going? I'm going to find some red wine and I'm going to drink it in front of the television. Is that okay? Yes. Yes. Meanwhile, son Ben, Christopher Weeks, is obsessed with Indigo, Leanna Walsman, Liam's former girlfriend who is in the dying phase of an affair with a married man, Gary Sweet. There's real talent in this film. It's been impressively directed by Weeks and the performances make you realise the depth of acting talent in this country. Noni Hazelhurst is just astounding as this woman who can't bear the thought of not being loved, not being wanted. Steve Rogers is heartbreaking as Jordan. Leanna Walsman makes Indigo so real, she's wonderful. And Matthew Newton is terrific as Ben's friend and potential lover. And I mustn't forget Reese Muldoon, who does such a good job playing Jordan's boss. If I have a qualm about the film, it is that the screenplay needed just a bit more glue to bring all the elements together. Despite that, it's a fine debut from this talented new filmmaker. David, what did you think? I think it's good. I really do. Um, I mean, I, I didn't feel that it needed any more glue, as you say. I mean, I, I thought it's a very understated film. It asks the, the viewer to fill in a lot of the feelings uh, and, and, and events that are going on. Um, there's long, still passages with no dialogue. So it makes the viewer work a little bit, I guess. But the performances are so beautiful and it's so well shot and yeah. framed. And, yeah. and, and I mean, I, I enjoy a film like this. I enjoy a film about relationships which, which, which is not obvious, which is, which is su subtle in all respects. Do you know, I had one problem, other problem with it, mm. and that was the casting of Steve Rogers. And he's such a fine performer, no, but he seemed to me too young for that role. I know what you mean, yes. And and I, so I thought, this is the father of a, you know, 20-something. You know, I thought that at the beginning, and then he's so good, and really he's very, very good, yeah. that uh, it didn't bother me after a while. It just, I just went with it. And um, I think this shows a tremendous amount of talent, and, and uh, uh, I, I hope people go and see it. What are you going to give I'm it? I'm going to give it four. I'm going to give it three and a half. I think... I think about you all the time. You're a really funny guy, Ben. You're a really funny guy. And yeah, I have a girlfriend. You're right. I love her. <laughs> but you know, Ben? Do you know? What? I don't want to miss maybe the greatest moments in life I might ever get. Bitter and Twisted is in limited release, so check our website for details. And that's all from us tonight, so good night. Good night.